On behalf of the National Steering Committee for Semiconductor Industry Development, Prime Minister Phạm Minh Chính highly appreciated the active participation of ministries, sectors, localities, research institutes, universities and businesses in advancing Vietnam's semiconductor industry. The Prime Minister outlined eight key areas of progress, heightened awareness, more decisive actions, improved institutional frameworks, positive outcomes in human resource training, infrastructure development, expanded cooperation, strong interest from key partners and enterprises, and the proactive engagement of research institutes, universities and local authorities. Vietnam must advance step by step, from low to high, from small to large, from simple to complex, with a breakthrough mindset. We must catch up, move forward together and rise above in developing our semiconductor industry. The entire nation must act with urgency and boldness. We must move fast and we must succeed, and our results must be sustainable and long-lasting. The Prime Minister emphasized that the development of Vietnam's semiconductor ecosystem must be inclusive, synchronized, comprehensive and effective. He called for the urgent completion of incentive mechanisms and policies guided by the principles of streamlined regulations, seamless infrastructure and intelligent human and institutional execution. Based on core priorities, Prime Minister Phạm Minh Chính assigned concrete tasks across various areas, including human resource training, ensuring sufficient power supply and securing transportation infrastructure. He specifically tasked the Ministry of Agriculture and Environment with proposing the inclusion of a legal framework for a list of strategic minerals essential to semiconductor industry development.